Hi everyone and welcome to this week's episode of Cap Trail Meetups. Uh, this week we have Heather from uh, who is the Regional Trails Program Director of the Friends of the Lower Appomattox River, also known as Polar. Heather, how are you today? Great, doing great. Thanks for having me. Of course, wonderful. All right, so first things first, what is Polar? <laughs> great, yeah, so Polar, like you said, is the Friends of the Lower Appomattox River, um, and we were formed over 20 years ago really as a grassroots organization to protect the Appomattox River and to provide more access to the river um, for the whole community. Uh, we work in the Tri-Cities region, and for those of you who don't know the Tri-Cities, that's the cities of Petersburg, Colonial Heights, Hopewell, as well as the counties of Prince George, Chesterfield, and Dinwiddie. So what are y'all doing right now? You're currently building the Appomattox River Trail, and it's being built into sections. Capitol Trail is built into five sections, and we, did not build them all in order. We built them piece by piece. So tell me a little bit about that. Yeah, we're really using the same process. Uh, like I said, we were all volunteer uh, organization for about 15 years. Right. And the volunteers really did start to build the trail, like you said, in those different sections across all six different localities. And then so in 2017, we wrote an uh, Appomattox River Trail Master Plan. And that master plan really looked at how to link those different pieces together to make a 25 mile continuous trail. Um, that was funded by the Cameron Foundation. And now we're working with that master plan in the region trying to fill in those gaps and make a continuous trail system. Oh, wonderful. So when is the trail supposed to be completed? Well, these are long-term projects, as, as you guys know. Uh, we're really looking at maybe 10 years to have the, the trail system completed. Uh, you know, like the Capitol Trail, it's going to have some on-road kind of more urban portions, and it's also going to have some more rural healing portions. It's going to kind of have that same feel going through different areas. Um, so the trail will look and feel a little different when it's done. Um, the other thing uh, when it's completed is we hope to have a connection to the Capitol Trail. There's actually been a, yes. yeah, there's been a regional study done on that already. Um, and that study recommends that when the Benjamin Harris Bridge is replaced someday, it should have bicycle and pedestrian accommodations. It's very long term. Um, right. But in the meantime, we're looking at maybe doing a shuttle between the two um, trail systems. Right. Well, we are hoping that happens. Um, so a little bit about you. How did you get involved with Fuller? Yeah, so I've been involved with Folar almost from the very beginning. Uh, I actually have been a forester and my major was forestry and recreation management. So this project this has always been really interesting to me. Um, so I've always volunteered with Folar, uh, partnered with Folar in my different roles and really fell in love with the region and with the project and really wanted just to get involved and do more. So excited to be able to do it every day, all day. Right, very fun. All right, so my last question is, I usually ask what your favorite spot on the Capitol Trail is, uh, but I wanna ask you what your favorite spot on the Appomattox River Trail is. Yeah, good question. Uh, there's a lot of great spots on the River Trail. I think uh, it just really depends on what you wanna do and, and what kind of day I'm having. Uh, you know, the Western End and Dinwiddie and, and Chesterfield is beautiful, it's very rural, there's lots of rocks and river, you know, rapids, so that's a great place to be alone. Um, if I want to grab lunch or, you know, coffee before or after my walk, Petersburg and Colonial Heights are the best sections. Um, and then, you know, if you want to kind of get a different river, wide river view, then um, Prince George and Hopewell is the place to go see the river in a different way, so. All six localities have my favorite spots in them. <laughs> I like how diverse you made that answer. That was great. All right, well, thank you so much for talking to me today. Yeah, great. Hope to connect our trail someday. Me too. <laughs> Bye. Bye.